Sumeru is a bit of a buggy map. It's beautiful and everything, but they didn't quite seal it up too tightly. And getting below the map is, well, as easy as walking out of it. I found numerous spots where this is possible. Some were far off the beaten path, while others were right alongside it. Let me show you one of those spots and one example of something neat that can be achieved by breaking out of the map. First thing you'll want to do is pay our pal the turkey a visit. That's the Jade Plume Terrace Room. If you've yet to unlock this area, it can easily be done by going to the northwest corner of Sumeru and hopping into this warp portal. Once in, it's time for climbing. We're going all the way to the ceiling. Yep, just like with the Bethysmal Bishops, the Coral Defenders, the devs left a gap up there. To be precise, you'll want to be here on the map, roughly center with this dip in the map's border. From this location, jump across the way and climb these rocks. Once you're up on the ledge onto a spot you can stand, switch to a smaller character. I was able to do this with a mid-height male like Xiao, but the smaller the character, the easier it'll be. Continue climbing up, and you'll see a gap in the rocks. Just crawl through that narrow space and... There you go, you're out of the map, and into the wild negative zone that surrounds the Jade Plume Terrace Room boss. There are a lot of neat skybox changes in this game, but this is one of the coolest for sure. Okay, so you're out of the map. Now what? Well, have fun of course, go explore! But as an example of something neat that can be done, let's go ahead and activate a certain teleport waypoint. A certain teleport waypoint that's underwater. You can see that, near Barbara here, the waypoint is definitely activated. I won't go too deep, yes this pun is intended, into the mechanics of how water works in this game. I've got other videos on Watatsumi Island, Dunyu Ruins, and Breaking into Shrines of Deaths if you'd like to know more about water mechanics. But the gist is that swimming in water only takes place near the surface. The ground below can be walked on. All we have to do is come up from below the water and activate the teleport waypoint. So from the location we broke out of the map, just make our way over to the teleport waypoint... It's not too much of a trek, but if you're following along and this is your first foray into exploring below the map, consider using Xiao if you have him. He's the best character for this stuff. Kazuha's a good second option. Okay, this convenient log that's directly below the teleport waypoint is our ticket in. Just land on it, climb all the way to the top, and... And there you have it. Open the map and teleport to the waypoint. You are now underwater, which is always the cooler option versus draining the water. Thanks for watching, hope you have fun outside the map, it's a good time journeying around in co-op, so bring some friends. And if you liked the video, do make sure to subscribe, got more Sumeru on the way. This is Musashi, signing off. Till next time.